Tri-State Cincinnati's Pride Week is just days away, and plans to make sure that it is safe are being finalized right now at City Hall. Nine on your sides, Tom McKee is live there with this new information. Tom. Well, and that meeting has just wrapped up here at City Hall involving leaders of Cincinnati Pride, the city manager, representatives at the police and fire department to go over every detail of that security plan. Of course, it goes into effect with the beginning of Pride Week this Saturday and runs through June 25th with the parade and the festival. Pride Week and the Pride Parade could draw well over 90,000 people to Cincinnati because of the support of others coming to town to remember the Orlando victims. Police Chief Elliot Isaac has a message for every one of them. The safety of everyone is always paramount, and, and we're going to make sure we do everything we can to provide that safety. Just like the All-Star Game last summer, there will be lots of police officers in uniform, plus many working undercover. Security cameras will monitor every corner of downtown. We'll be there in all facets. You know, we, we're going to do everything within our capabilities to make sure it's a safe event for all and that everybody's able to come out and feel safe and secure. I asked Chief Isaac how difficult it was to do that with such a large area to cover. Those things are always a challenge, but, you know, we, we have a lot of experience in doing it, and Cincinnati does it well. That includes events like Riverfest, which has run safely for decades. City Council Member Christopher Smitherman says that's the way it should be. One of the things that we're not going to do as a country is live in fear. So the worst thing we could do is say that, hey, this event isn't going to happen. Leaders of Cincinnati Pride like Sean Baker look at things this way. We go forward stronger, taller. But as with any big event in this day and age, personal awareness is key. If they see anything that's odd, that we want them to immediately communicate that to authorities. Do not be bashful with information. We'd rather more information than less. I just talked with city manager Harry Black, who told me that some of these officers will be seen, some unseen, and you'll be seen on camera, security cameras throughout the city. John McKee, not on your side, live at City Hall.